breaking news. Nnamdi Kanu uncovered the inscriptions of the S men on the new Nigerian passports. The leader of the outlawed indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, Nnamdi Kanu, has made a new discovery in the new international passport introduced by the Nigerian government to prove its alleged colonization agenda by Buhari's government. He claims that his new discovery is proof that the government of Nigeria is pursuing a pro Fulani agenda at the detriment of other ethnic nationalities. The pro Biafran group leader has always accused the Buhari led Nigerian government of a covert agenda to make his Fulani ethnic group lord over other ethnic groups in the country, an allegation which the presidency has always denied. The former president, Olusheg Ngoba Sanjo, has currently also branded the aim of the terror sect Boko Haram as Fulanization of West Africa and Islamization of Africa. Kanu, in his tweets, on his Twitter handled on Thursday, posted a picture he claimed is a new Nigerian passport showing a picture of Katsu elders and their Katsu and acts rhetorically. And now that we have terror headsmen and their cows on their new international passport, do you still have any doubts? Viewers, thank you for listening to this news. As you can see, new things are being discovered day after day concerning Fulani headsmen and President Muhammadu Buhari. What is this new inscription on the new international passport and why? Is it written there? I think Nigerians have a lot of questions to ask our president, Momodu Buhari, and make sure that that inscription has nothing to do with Islamization in Nigeria. Please, viewers, to get more information, kindly drop your comments below, click on the subscribe button, and also click on the bell button to get more notifications. Thank you.